is Rage, and welcome to Afterbirth Plus. Today, I want to do some greedier. Now, I'm speaking quietly because it's really late at night, and I know, but can you imagine actually having uh, someone uh, making videos, but they really have to be quiet because there's someone right next to them asleep and tied up so they can't escape, but bless them, they're asleep. Don't you just love victims when they're lovely and asleep? Oh, they're adorable. So we're going to greet you. Yes, we are. I have no idea what to expect. So, uh, holy righteousness, yoke and Jesus. One of those things is not like the other. <laughs> what do we got? Oh, we have pinkish splodge. I feel like maybe it's an arm. Is it an arm? I don't know what 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 is that? Like what is that? I have no idea. I kind of want to just absorb this cuz genuinely I think that's more useful than having it. And let's go for this then. I'm assuming it's, you know, the hard mode of greed mode. So we're up for difficulty. But no, it is legitimately fairly late at night. But I was like, no, I need to play more. I need it. I need it. I need it. So I needed it. And now we're here. But I hate walking around dark houses. I really, really do. And I actually had a little, like, think to myself while I was stood in a dark room because I'm such a masochist. Imagine if you were ever in a truly 100% dark environment, you instantly got grabbed by the Dark Ones. I know, original, original name, you know, and all that. But think about it. It works because when are you ever... There's a lot of enemies right now. I'm getting a little bit concerned, but that should be okay. How often can you truly say you are in a 100% dark environment? Holy moly! Um, just gotta really, really. Oh, good! More friends! Haha, <laughs> yeah, that's a. Uh, this is good. This is totally. Totally awesome! Oh, and some more! Yes! Let's have some more! Alright, look. I have a feeling now I'm getting a little bit more as to what the big deal with Greedier is. Because basically, from what I'm seeing, it is what the fuck. I need to focus. I need to focus. I need to dodge. I need to dodge and weave. Oh god, one more hit and I am dead. Yeah, look, I'm dead. I'm gonna say this now. I'm gonna say this right now. Because I- yeah. <laughs> I think then we may have to cancel the waves. Because that is absolutely, unbelievably, irrevocably ridiculous. I'm sad we don't get to see what that new item is, but I underestimated it. I did. I underestimated Greedier, and that's fine, but it's okay. We're not going for any streaks or anything. This is a learning process, and we can learn. So I need to get really focused here, and I need to kill stuff as it spawns, because it seems like it's very easy to get overwhelmed in Greedier, because it starts off fairly tame. Like, you know, there's just there's just a normal greed mode. It's all right, nothing crazy going on here, but no. No, apparently, apparently it is a slow, insidious killer, like strongest neurotoxin. That is what is currently happening. Oh my god, my room is being filled with neurotoxin. <laughs> no. <laughs> Either way. The Dark Ones, like a race of creatures that can only operate in full darkness, existed since the dawn of man, but can never really strike, because how often is true darkness? Because even when you're lying in bed in a dark room going to sleep, there's always a little bit of light, because if there wasn't, you won't be able to see anything, and you can always see something. Alright, look, I think I need to tactically stop this, because we're going to get overwhelmed, and it's pointless me just hammering my head repeatedly against something that's not going to happen. I think the only way we can really get away with it is if we're playing a different character that's more powerful, like Zazzy Boy, or we get a ridiculous good start, get into the item room before the waves, get a good items, because as it stands right now... This is very real. It really is. But yeah, it really kind of weirds me out to think that there never really is true darkness. True darkness where your hand an inch in front of your face and you can't see it. Have you ever experienced darkness that thick? Darkness that just 
consuming darkness with such overwhelming presence. Because I've never... I, I don't think I can honestly ever say that I've had that. And I want Cube of Me over-absorbing it because I think it is going to be helpful for us. And I'm also going to go into the curse room and have a little look. That's not bad, mainly because we do have an extra health to acquire here, which I think is probably good. So let's continue onwards and we should be in good situations. I can use Cube of Meat for much profit in greedier mod. I, again, I don't know why I'm defaulting to Russian. Okay, all right. You now become the last impression that you did. How do you feel about that? Is that okay? <laughs> I'm gonna die. Greedier mode is seriously not taking prisoners. Like, it is not, granted the entire game doesn't take prison, it's not like you die and you instead get sent to some sort of cell. Please, please die. Please just die. This is all well and good. Please die. Oh, I did it! I got to the boss! Yeah! I'm buying freaking health on the first floor in greed mode. What is this? The thing is, I genuinely think the bosses will be easier than that ridiculousness that was those waves. Fortunately, we're going to be able to afford to get into the next item room, so that's the big deal. Is it just me, or was the timer a lot shorter there? I feel like what happened is that the timer was ridiculously shorter there, and I kind of want to kill Duke of Flies before I kill these hauntlings, but that does of course mean somehow getting to him without recklessly taking a absolutely metric crap ton of damage. That was a nice little cube of meat, and that was also a nice little cube of meat. There we go! That was a lovely cube of meat! I am a master at using my meat effectively. Alright. Oh, yep, I forget how, like, you know, brimstone, that's kind of important information to retain about the haunt here. But in theory, this should be okay. Now, the real question is, do I want to... Oh, my bloody lord. That was intense. That was intense. Can you do something, please, haunt? That would be really... Really cool, if you could, uh, please. Okay, there we go. I know that was a risk, but I felt like it was a risk we needed to take. And a risk that we don't need to take is the devil deal. So if you'll excuse me, I'm going to move on and not die to the transition room. Darkness people be damned, this is crunk. Ah, oh, I just said crunk. Who says crunk? Even people, who even are the type of people that say crunk, unironically, in a, in a cool way. I don't even know. I just, I don't know. Oh, that's good. Yes, that is good. We need the bombs. We need the heart. That is just solid. So in terms of actually, oh, what are you? It's a new type of bomb, but... The question is, what type of bomb? Very, very exciting. I'm gonna blow this up, just in case we get a little bit of extra moolah. We don't. I'm gonna blow this up, just in case we get a key, or... I mean, we got replacement bombs and some extra money. That's fine. See, I do want to get the black candle. I do. But I also want to be able to afford the new item. I also want to be able to go into the shop. I mean, technically, we're gonna get enough money to do that. So, I guess we do. I guess we do, and I'll see what's in the item room first before I buy the black candle, but I feel like it's... Oh, it's like a little ghost turnip type thing? Ghost pepper! See? I was not far away! Ghost pepper, of course, one of the spiciest things in existence. Grow high up in mountain ranges. Very, very spicy. Like, you can't taste anything spiciness. Not that I know how this is going to affect our tears, but that's the real life plant for you. Okay... This is fine. So, we've seen a little bit of what the first floor has to offer. Yeah, the timer is definitely shorter. That's why it feels so overwhelming. There is a high chance of being just completely and utterly compounded with enemies until you are so, so unbelievably done. Oh, that was pretty snazzy, but unfortunately it's a champion. But it died anyway, yes! And that was pretty pathetic, but that's okay. 
We managed to have a nice little clear. See, that's the thing. I assume that black hearts in this new mode are excellent simply because we can clear the room really, really nicely with them. Oh, look, we just actually fired a fire. Ooh, if only it made every tier that, it would be so cool to have an actual fire-firing item. God, I'm so excited for future Synergy Labs when we're back online with that. There seems some really, really cool stuff to work with. There really does. Yeah, the timer does seem to be getting a little bit longer again. That was a great time for my Ghost Pepper to get involved, as was that. We should be alright. So I've at least done all of this floor without having to bitch out and stop the counter. So that's very, very good. Careful. Get the fire. Looking good. Push him onto the fire. Now, granted, without the extra black heart, we probably would be dead right here. So that's fine. And... Come on. Please die. Please just die. And it did. See, you ask nicely and you get. Is it just me or are we getting less money than normal as well? Look, I need to buy a health, and I'm just going to hope that we get six coins. I'm sorry, whatever you are. You look lovely, but survival is key here. Survival is absolutely key. Now, I do really, really want to use the cube of meat on him, but at the same time, he's just going to stomp on me, isn't he? He's just completely and utterly going to stomp on me. Hello. Totally forgot about the whole, you know, like, giant enemies spawning really rapidly in a ridiculously uh, racy roadway. Oh, look, I wanted more Rs. There wasn't more Rs. You know, you gotta forgive me. I'm in under a lot of stress. I'm in under a lot of stress. I am swimming in stress. If stress was a liquid, what color would it be? It's not important, but I, I worry about these things. Okay, this is fine. Get my fire going. I am really liking these. What? I was already moving when he jumped. How could I dodge that any harder than I just did? Like, legitimately, how could I dodge that any harder than I just did? And we're going to have exactly enough money to buy that, which is wonderful. And the fire tier did a lot. So it's basically the candle space bar item every now and then coming out of my face, which is really excellent. I wish I could fire fire with my face in real life. It would be phenomenal. Oh, all right. Can you please die? That's wonderful. All right. What are you? A mama mega. Doesn't have a use. Huh. Interesting. I did not expect a space bar item. Well, let's summon the boss, and I guess... I guess we use it, and... Oh! Oh, it freaking annihilates the room! Okay. Does it annihilate every room? Because it did annihilation on the devil deal. That's really cool. Like, granted, it was a massive waste, but... Shit, that's cool. Okay, look, it's doing it every now and then. Please tell me it's going to continue on to the next floor. Look at it! It's annihilating every room I walk into! That is sweet. I have a feeling it's not going to continue on to the next floor. No, that is a shame, but at least now we know what it is, and we can work with that in the future. That is very, very cool. What an awesome item. Oh, what an awesome item. We definitely want that. Four Spirit Hearts is a godsend here, and we can now more comfortably get this curse room, which is even better, because we got ourselves some bombs. I'm going to risk a spirit room. A spirit room? Yes, a spirit room. Oh, that is a shame. That is a shame. See, I'd probably go for that if I had the keys to do so. I'm going to blow these two up. We've got a fair amount of bombs, and yes, there we go. That's exactly what I was hoping for. Darkness people, be damned. They're everywhere. They're watching you right now. Hey! Acid tears. We've got acid and fire. I mean, this is a pretty cool tier setup. I'm not going to lie. And I guess it's time to boldly go into glorious battle and hope for the best. Hope for just... Just so much the best. 
Well, you're gonna get annihilated by those bombs. That is very, very fortuitous. In fact, yeah, the waves that are just simply a round of troll bombs are actually amazing now because they just, they basically represent just a nice little break in the awfulness that is these waves. It really does, which is just fantastic. How the hell did he hit me with that? That is one accurate goddamn bony over there. And I know they're normally pretty accurate, but damn, son, that was insane. All right, kind of want to blow you up next to the enemies. That seems like a good idea. Careful, careful. Got to keep an eye on everyone. Careful of the zombies. Could we have you die, please? Yes! Lovely! Lovely, lovely, lovely. I did get very lucky there. Admittedly, there was a large amount of surprise explosions and it was very good. And we are definitely getting less money than normal. There is no question in my mind about that right now. The real question is, do I re-roll or do I do the boss first? Because I'm going to have enough money to buy an item, so I suppose in that sense I should probably re-roll. That's convenient. We're going to get the next boss soon. I really want to kill this guy in time. Just not. Who's the other boss? Oh, it's a little bit of gate action. Fantastic. Really, really super fantastic. Just... Just awesome. Yay! All right, he's dead. That is good. That is good. Let's get, get rid of his little friends. Get rid of his little friends. Say hello to his little friends waggling across the room. All right, Champion Gate. In theory, this should be fine just because we have so much space to fight him. And the actual flame tears are blocking bullets. I mean, granted, they're also blocking my own bullets, which is less than useful, but that's still a nice little double-edged sword to be working with as I walk with the enemy tears, like the genius-level intellect that I command the power to walk into death. You know, that is actually a good power because most humans psychologically are incapable of walking to their own death because the drive to survive is a base and undeniable animal instinct that most of the population share. So if you could actually ignore that fully and willingly go into your own death, that's actually bloody impressive. But also, what the fuck are you doing? You're going to die. I just got to throw these down. You know, you got you to put these things in perspective. Give me a good item, please. I'm tempted to take the meat, but at the same time, we need something better than that. The D6 is tempting as hell. In fact, what am I doing with my life? We don't need to choose between them. We just, we just, uh, we just void it, right? Oh, look, it technically re-rolled before disappearing. I mean, it sucks I'm not going to be able to have triple shot, but at the same time, triple shot isn't strictly better. So, uh, Teratoma it is. And Teratoma should be fine. We're not in any rush, nothing else is going to spawn, so we can just nice and safely slowly kill through the little parts, get rid of the spiders, then we'll break the big one around, and we'll just, we'll just take it in pieces, okay? We'll take it in nice, manageable chunks! That's not, not what I had in mind there, <laughs> Really not. I mean, the irony. Manageable chunks. Oh, what? Really, Rage? You want us to explode all over the entire room right immediately now? That's great. Oh, God. At least we might get to be able to see what acid tears actually do. It did look like one of my tears splashed against the rock and destroyed it. In which case, that's really, really cool. But I don't know if that was teratoma or rocks just randomly exploding like they occasionally like to. But there is one way to experiment with that as we get a lovely angel room. Are you gonna... Yes! That's awesome! I'm glad I noticed that. And that's also fantastic. Loads of money and some much needed health. Okay, hang on a minute. Oh, can it? I kind of wanted to check if Acid Tears can open up a door if they can explode rocks, but it doesn't seem like it. Unless it's just the property of this room in a greed run, I don't know. But for the most part, I feel like I'm doing okay, considering this is, you know, a good first foray into greedier. Definitely want the health and the keys. That is fantastic. I feel like any way of... Yes! Oh, sweet, glorious squirrel skins. That is what we need right here. That is what we need. Not a great floor in terms of items. So actually, I just realized then, if we can melt through rocks, it seems only pertinent that we want to, yeah, grab ourselves that. 
I don't want to lose this in the curse room, the heart, so I'm going to wait until after I've probably lost it thanks to a good beatdown from whatever is in that room. And then I guess I want to go through here, grab that, and maybe re-roll? I mean, we can, right? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's re-roll. Ooh, the blue clap. The blue clap. God, I can't speak. I don't know what it is, but when it gets slightly late at night, I do lose the ability to... Um, are those waves happening every couple seconds? Is that... Is that what's occurring here? Let's... Let's stop that right now before this comes to a very, very premature end, and I don't think any of us wants that right now. Definitely not me. Let's just have a have a real nice little chill because we do have a lot of Potential here as well as enough money to get an item to help with the rest of the wave because obviously I knew I'd take tactical uh, Golden heart popping uh, damage, you know the reason I did that is because the dark ones didn't want me to seriously They're behind you help me, please <laughs> and uh, that should for the most part be okay be okay, you must be okay as a content retiree, be okay as a cat that's having a nap, be okay, you just got a great deal online, be okay, it's just like the average uplifting song, it's nothing great, but you know, it's, it's nice. <laughs> That is wonderful. Let me melt you. Holy hell. Can we please get through this with some sort of freaking speed? Holy moly. Holy moly. Can we please no stop? It's over. It's totally fucking over, isn't it? It's so, so unbelievably over. No, it's not over. We're okay. We're okay. We've reached a point that we've actually calmed down, but apparently this floor is a big step up from the previous floor. Like, we are reasonably powerful here. Not crazy powerful, but we're reasonably powerful. We got a few nice tier effects. We got proptosis. It's all good on that front. And we just got hammered there. Like, absolutely hammered. Greedier is insanier. And that is the technical term. I'm actually going to spend all my remaining money on health, because I really do feel like it is that necessary. And then we are going to do this last little wave here. Careful, don't want to lose any unnecessary... Don't want to lose any more unnecessary health is obviously what I was saying there. Okay, this is good. This is good. So we got to do the boss. I feel like I do need to stop the second boss from spawning. I feel like that's something I need. I might as well go around and blow up these rocks, right? Because then they might have health in. That might help us out. That seems like a good idea. It really is encouraging me to really think about what I'm doing, which I guess is a good thing, right? You kind of want that from super hard, air quotes, greed mode. And I say air quotes, it is just, you know, super hard. What you got for me? Couple bits of money? That's actually not bad, because then I can buy more health. Oh, it is so tragic. It is so unbelievably tragic. This is actually a really easy set of bosses, so we don't have to cancel it. We got very, very lucky, I feel, with this. We really did. And then Loki, actually, that's fine, too. It really, really is. We can cube of meat him down for the majority. I feel like he just swapped with one of them. No, he didn't. He did die. They have a lot more health than I uh, recall them having, but that's okay. You know, they're not half as strong as they think they are. <laughs> half, as, half as strong as they think they are. Okay, careful. And we are good. Just gonna melt away the normal Loki, and all should be well with the world. We are very, very lucky to have two ridiculously easy bosses on this floor, because based on how the normal waves went, I really wasn't fancying our chances. I very, very much wasn't. And you are dead! Nope, now you are dead. Sorry for lying about it. I, I do apologize. 
I kind of want the devil deal. I kind of regret my decision. Well, not really. It should be a relatively simple affair to get rid of the first cage, and uh, then it becomes really easy because we just need to stand kind of slightly to the right of the room and kill the other one while he can't really do anything. So this is fine. That brimstone was nearly a little bit too close for comfort, but for the most part, we're okay. Now, if you could just brimstone and clear up your little helpers, that'd be really, really nice too. Lovely! Now you're going to die, my friend! Now you are going to die. I do like the gate as a boss, because effectively what he is doing is going, GO MY MINIONS! <laughs> go into battle! <laughs> no, no, seriously, go into battle! Um, really? Are you- is this okay? Like, you seem to be sniggering a little bit there. I mean, you're, you're barely containing this sort of childish glee. You're not- you're not planning anything. No, 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 go, no, because you won't be thinking about maybe brimstoning us in the- in the back of the head or anything, would you? You won't be- you won't be considering that. What? No, no, I- Me? No, come on, guys. It's a battle. Come on, come on, come on. All right, I'm- I'm trusting you. Here I- here I go. Yeah, no, go battle, go battle, go battle. Okay, I'm going. I'm going. I'm here. Blah! I fucking- yeah. And that just repeats as his reserves keep watching the front line get melted by their general. It just seems an inefficient strategy for general battle. It really does. Huh. How do I re-roll that which gets absorbed? That's what I don't understand. <laughs> does it just absorb both? I feel like it just absorbs both items at that point. Either way, we definitely want Pageant Boy because we need all the money we can get when we are so ridiculously coin starved. Can it put out fires? Oh, it can't quite put out fires. That's a little bit sad. It really is. But then again, it would be ridiculous if it could. And uh, nothing there. Give us these two. Come on. I'm very excited to see how Flame Tears operates when you get a load of luck and actually start spewing them pretty consistently. I think that would be really, really cool. Not a lot to go on here. I'm going to blow up this just in case of good stuff. Oh, a bit of puberty never hurt anyone, right? That's fine. Do I want to go? I'm going to go in here just because we do have the ability to buy a heart back. And I'm thinking... Ooh. Ooh, that was regret. That was a lot of regret. So based on how the previous floor went, this should be counting down in seconds, right? In just absolute seconds. Oh my god, that was uh, unfortunate. I did get really, really hemmed in by the ghost there, but that's okay. We're actually firing piercing tears fairly frequently. It's been quite the godsend in this. Okay, guys, this is fine. This is fine. We'll take one more wave, and then I think I am going to pause it, just because we're getting loads of- THAT WAS LUCKY! Come <laughs> guy just- WHAT ARE YOU DOING?! He just spawned, and then piled his entire body into the fire! What a guy! <laughs> what a guy! Just a guy of a focus! That was amazing the way it looked as well. It just piled. <laughs> Why is that so funny to me? It really is. <laughs> it's because it was so long as well. I could do nothing but watch. Like, seriously. <laughs> it's probably because it's late. I'm finding that a lot funnier than I rightly should, but come on. Oh my god, come on. Alright, I'm gonna re-roll, I think, because although the tears up could be good, it's not like we desperately need tears up, and we just desperately need something of use here. That's not great. That's not great at all. <sighs> I'm gonna re-roll once more, and if not, I'm just gonna buy health. Like, there's, there's not really anything else to it here. Yeah, nope, that's not happening. And, well, the raw liver might be worth it, but then again, is it? Ah, it's, it's a close one. It's a very, very close one. Yeah, you know what's great. With the amount of health that we buy, it probably is worth it just to get this nice little boost here. Oh, good. 
Oh good, I really... I was just thinking to myself, you know, what's the best boss that could be here? And while I did accidentally step on that, it probably actually is a really, really good thing that it did happen. Because we don't want to be trapped fighting the bloat for longer than we did. Also, did we not even get money for that? Like, straight up, did we just not get money for the bloat? Because that seems very, very unfair. Alright, get destroyed, get destroyed, walk on my fire, there's a good death, there's a good death, keep that going, that is wonderful, the odd piercing tear should be helping me, we got one more fire, lovely, and put my meat in them, that is good, phrasing I know, and there we have it, that was veritably good, that was very much veritably good, this however... Less veritably good, but I'd rather face this than double fallen at the very least. So we got that going for us. It's just when the brimstone start a spamming, we are in a lot of trouble. I thought that was really quite good, but no, I apparently failed horribly at dodging that. And there we have it. Come on, give me the goods. Well, I mean, at this point, two black hearts really are the goods. I'm not expecting to beat the final boss of Greedia, which I can only assume is some form of mega, mega, super, ultra, fantastic greed. But at the same time, we should at least be able to see him, right? We just need to get through the shop, and then all is well with the world. And there is nothing else here. Oh, that just sucks. I couldn't really avoid that. Any tinted rocks to destroy? No? On we go then, guys. I'm hoping the shop has some sort of respite. That would be lovely. But I don't think it's going to happen. Alright, that's a new trinket. That's a new item that actually looks really cool. Like a ring, maybe? Or like a, like a mini horse saddle? I'm probably interpreting it really badly, actually. <sighs> Alright, let's grab this extra half heart. And then into the... Into the breach we go. Into the breach we go. At least I am doing a very, very respectable amount of damage. Especially with that nice bit of tactical black hearting there. Just to, just to get ahead. Oh, he can summon those spiders, can he? He can summon those ones. That's really good. You know, I'm really happy that he can do that. Also, that was just an obscene amount of tears that was uh, hurtling towards me. Like, absolutely ridiculous. What is damaging me so frequently? Was I just not seeing some tears that were, like, hurtling towards me, or am I going crazy here? I want to stop this, because I need a moment of rest. I mean, I'm not 100% sure we're going to get to see what this new item is, because I'm about to be buying a lot of health. Unless I can somehow afford it with the limited gold on the ground, which I don't see happening. Yeah, that's nine. It's nine, and it's also nine. I'll buy one heart and try and continue, because I do really want it. Because at this point, I don't know what the, you know, air quotes, the good items are. So, I could be about to get something brimstone level and not realize it. And I don't want that to end up happening. Did Greed just die? Greed just died. That's very, very convenient. Get rid of you. Go away from me, bomb. Don't want that anywhere near me. Though I do kind of want to use his bombs to kill other things. That might be a very, very nice way of using it. But at the same time, it's probably not worth it now, is it? This should be good just because we do have uh, the piercing tears. That was a very, very nice use of uh, the fire there. That was good. Keep that going. Keep that going. And we've got some hands coming down. That should be okay. Dodge, 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 and weave. Kill them off. Kill them off. And we're good. Guys, I can confirm. <gasps> I can confirm that we're good. That we are thoroughly and completely good. We should at least see what the boss of this floor is. <laughs> we didn't really get a lot of money for these last few waves. Like, hardly any. I'm just going to have to go for it. Like, there's no there's no alternative here. I'm just going to have to go for it. Big part of me is screaming. It is screaming and yelling. And in fact, it's, it's won. The part of me that was screaming and yelling has won. Stop the presses. Holy hell. We are going to die. These are fucking Speedy Gonzales, the Worm Brothers. And we just, we don't want that anywhere near us. How none of them are dead yet, I'm not sure. Given just you know, how much damage we are outputting here. But at the same time, 
I guess I just need to keep going. I think what is happening is that I am very typically nicely, evenly injuring them all to the point where it's just not happening. Can you imagine fighting another boss while this is occurring? I think I made a very good choice here not to fight them on top of each other. I think I would have died, definitely. I love how much strategy this is requiring. The question is then, what the bollocks do I do here? That is the question. I didn't get any money from that. I'm tempted to stand on the button and just see. I, I feel like maybe that might work, but at the same time, could I just go in the curse room? I can always buy health if it backfires, because I will need to just buy health, but I really want to see what this thing is. Like, there's no other way to get any sort of money from here. Do I trust myself to take the next boss on a heart and a half? I, I'd say no is the answer. Let's go for the curse room. Let's go for the curse room and get some spirit hearts. No. Let's, let's not do that then. That's great. I don't have a choice. I've just got to... I'm sorry, whatever you are. And I'm sorry if it's amazing, but I... I can't. I just... I can't. I'll put one coin in you and hope for the best. Don't leave the... <laughs> like I needed somebody to tell me that. Are you crazy? You're crazy. You're crazy. Yeah, I'm just going to buy a shit ton of health. We don't really have a choice. We just don't. Not that this was going to give me enough coin. Yeah, three. Oh, no. Imagine fighting the speedy worms on top of these three. Wow. I am very, very happy that I chose to not take that horrific and suicidal path. I very, very much am. That would have been just the worst. Like, absolutely just the worst. I'm already taking enough of a hit to them. I, I would have died. Like, I would have died. Based on the health that I had left, I would have died. Okay. Let's go down here, I guess, and see what's going on. Maybe get some extra money from these fires, but I doubt it. <laughs> oh, greedier mode is going to take some getting used to. Maybe this final devil deal will give us the glory that we require, the items that will save the day. I got to go for it. I do got to go for it. As much as this is going to be awful in so, so many ways, I do have to make it happen. We'll chew through these guys so we got more space to work with. But for the most part, this seems like a fairly easy one. I was expecting the Devil Deal phase on this final floor to have really taken a ramp up in difficulty. But no, we do seem to be good. I'm just hoping that it is just normal greed and the harder difficulty came from the floors being a lot harder. But really... I have no idea. I also have... Oh, yeah, that's fair. Just just pop up underneath me. That's totally dodgeable. No, no, that makes sense. You, you do whatever you want. Just pop up underneath me. I'm okay with that. That's totally not BS. What the fuck? How is that? That's not something that you can counter. You can't counter what you can't see. I am a little bit upset that that's a thing that can apparently happen with those guys. I don't know why I've never really thought of it before as a factor. Oh, good. I think he's over here. There we go. All right, please. 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 That's not horrible. It's a bit of health, and really, what more could I ask at this point? So, yeah. Here we go. <laughs> here we. Here we go. Here we go. Please, please don't be as bad as I feel like it's going to be. I mean, it still says Ultra Greed, unless it is just like a super champion version of Ultra Greed, which it might be, because admittedly, I'm not having a super powerful run here. I've got a fairly good amount of damage, but even then, it is not cray cray. All right, still seems like it's Ultra Greed, so it does just seem like a much harder way of actually getting to it, so I guess that's fine. And obviously, he's spawning those bastards. No, no, you don't need to spawn them. You really, really don't. Okay, this is going to be a very long and very taxing fight. I'm honestly not even sure if I can do it. I really don't. is a terrible long day. Never mind the day today. I'm not watching this version of my All right, so I'm going to leave the side. 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 I'm going to
Please drive. Oh no 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 please please no 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 this is so brutal in every single respect. This is so brutal. I actually don't know how you do this. I'm just actually looking amazing. I'm just on. I really, I feel like there's only so well I can play. I feel like this like for a long time. I've been holding. I've been kicking for a while. Without any major difficulties or anything. It's about nutrition. I can't make it. I'm just full. I know. And I can't stop from caring. Please, no, 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 no. Stop, stop. This explosion will hold me. Wonderful. Really, really wonderful. Really. Oh, read, 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 read. This is just ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. And I don't know how to make it less of us. Oh, God, listen, please. Yeah, just honestly, I'm not sure if I like you. I'm really genuinely not because it seems so arbitrary. Like the main thing having enough money, just it just makes it so that the biggest thing is only to do well is not having to play anything like that. It's just legitimately if you're really good, it's really helpful. And there's not much else you can do to actually give yourself a chance here. That kind of stuff really does. Like an absolute marriage, you know, I could put freaking yourself to shame, but at the end of the day, it's just ridiculous. Like, it's absolutely, genuinely ridiculous. Like, challenge here is no challenge, it genuinely feels. I don't want to say unfair because it's doable, it is, but it's, it's approaching. It's approaching so high, it's not fun. And at that point, you don't do it. Alright, at that point, you don't do it. Like, I'm fighting hell here, and I don't know how to leave. I don't know how to leave. I think I'd be wrong, 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 i would be that can explode. You can die. Oh, good. Summon more of them. No, no, really. I, I implore you, Ultra Greed. Summon more of them. That was unexpected as hell. But that's fine. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. <laughs> I just want to survive as long as I can as a, as a beacon of pride at this point. It really is just as a beacon of pride. Because I can't hurt him. I just can't do it. <laughs> there is nothing. <laughs> there is nothing. Hi, zombies. <laughs> Putting the fire in front of the door is really, really useful. If only I had some more control over that, but, you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. That was intense. That was, that was fairly up there on, on the intense scale. Die. Oh, good. Time for some more coins. Let's get very, very far away from greed and everything that he stands for. That'd be very, very cool. That's a lot of spiders. That's a sudden large amount of these spiders. It really, really, really is. Can you die? That's good. All right, another another wave of them. That's fine too. That's, that's excellent right here. Let's just keep that going. That's fine. Ooh. <laughs> uh, at least he does keep clearing the room for me every now and then. Uh, ah! I feel like I did okay. I do. <laughs> I feel like I did okay. But that was some BS. That was some BS. My name has been Rage. Like if you enjoyed this greediness. <laughs> and subscribe for more. Oh, Goodbye. <laughs>